Hey everyone, Tim from Team Ohio Detectors. It's a beautiful day in north central Ohio. I'm out here at an old park in the north end of the city. Let's see what we can find today. I got a fresh supply of cigars. I'm ready to roll. Not even two minutes in. First find of the day. A uh, Pepsi cab. Twist off. Oh well, on to the next. And the first find of the day is a 2000 or 2001. I can't make out the last number clearly. A uh, Lincoln Memorial Penny. In the fine pocket it goes. Moving on. Second find of the day, just uh, about an inch down. Looks like a dime. Uh, Rosie. Uh, I think it's a 1995. Not sure. Into the fine pouch it goes. And we're on board with what looks like a nickel. It wasn't down, but about an inch. This uh, ground I'm digging in right now has a lot of gravel under it. Like it used to be a service drive for this park. And of course my glasses are in the truck so I'm not going to be able to read it. We'll find out what it is during the wrap up. And the next find of the day, down about uh, six inches is a, I think it's a 88 nickel. I'm reading it right. Had a little bit of a delay. Had to rehydrate. It's pretty hot out today. And I got a son from a phone call from my son in Florida. That always makes me happy. On to Signal the next was one. a scratchy 53 and it kept jumping up to 66, 68. So I'm not sure what this is going to be. Huh. Again, I'm using an AT. I'm still not familiar enough with it yet to know exactly what all the numbers are, what they might indicate. Still a work in progress. This is an aside. This park I'm hunting at has a baseball field. And, uh, the summer I graduated in 1975 and 1976, I played semi-pro baseball here for two years. Kind of brings back memories. Nostalgic. Let's see what we've got here. First we'll check and see if anything is in the plug. Also using a Garrett Pro pointer. To, well, let's see. Check the hole. Uh, whatever it is is still down here. I can hear it chirping at me. Apparently, I didn't go deep enough. And I'll uh, be back in a minute. Okay, dug into the side of the hole a little bit, and it appears that whatever it is. Below there. Now let's see what it is. And it's Mr. Pull Tab. Yeah, it always makes me happy. Okay, very nice. <clears throat> this is your typical iron signal. It's about a 33. Luckily, it was laying like that in the ground and not like that. And I have no idea why it's in the middle of a soccer field. Okay. On this is my second one. hole in about a three foot radius. And I got two pennies a little earlier. And it looks like I might have two more. Somebody had a hole in their pocket. I'll clean them up and we'll look at them during the wrap up. This is a spot that just keeps on giving. Here's another uh, penny. I dug this one in about a four inch circle and it actually uh, connected with the last hole. 
pays to, uh, after you dig a target, to run your detector back over the hole again. And it's about six coins within about a three foot radius here. So I'm going to keep the checking. latest one. This must be uh, pull tab and penny day. Looks like another uh, memorial. Hey, I'm keeping them. They add up. On. And here's the next one. Looks like a quarter. Down about four inches. At least I think it's a quarter. Can't be sure. It might be a steak quarter. And again, this is why you always recheck your hole. I pulled a piece of foil out and still got uh, a signal in the hole. And it looks like I've got two quarters that were also in the same hole, a little bit deeper. Again, same hole. Still getting a signal in it. So I'll live dig this to see if we come out with anything else. This is a grassy area that's grown over top of the part of the gravel parking lot of the ball field. As you can see, there's a lot of parking lot size rocks down in here. And it's tough digging. It's all about going back to the truck and getting the dynamite. I'm sure the parks department of this city wouldn't appreciate it. Okay, the rest of the signals I was getting were uh, these three uh, pieces of metal, I guess. One certainly looks like a rock to me, but it was setting off my pinpointer. Uh, I'm not sure what terracotta is, but maybe that's it. Okay, heading back to the truck. It's been a long day. Here's a wrap-up. This is today's uh, take for the park hunt. About three, three and a half hours. A couple nails, uh, pull tabs, a couple beaver tails, several pieces of wadded up foil, bottle caps, and uh, those magnetic, uh, they're either rocks or pieces of metal. I'm not sure which. As far as what I'm keeping, I got three quarters, and all three of them are state quarters a nickel, a dime, a fishing sinker, and nine, ten, eleven pennies that's it for today um, try to get out of here again tomorrow I covered maybe 50 square yards just all kinds of signals a lot of them I didn't dig that I knew were trash um, well let somebody else dig those up have a good one that's all for now God bless